Okay, welcome, welcome. Let me unpause the recording. And I just want to say welcome. I'm so glad that you're here tonight. It is Monday, July 17th. Can you believe it? It's been 13 days since our 4th of July celebration. And I'm just excited to be here tonight. We're going to talk about a couple things. And I might have to grab my drink, but um, I want to share with you some tools, got tools, girls, some tools to help you elevate your skincare and makeup result. So I'm going to check and see um, what I normally do is just check and make sure that we're in the right group because I have several groups and I want to make sure. Oh, I see Trisha. Okay. Hello, hello, hello. So glad you guys are here. Um, let's do this. So as I mentioned, we're going to talk about the tools to elevate your skincare and makeup results. So I'm going to just go ahead and get started. It's going to be kind of short. I believe it'll be short tonight. Um, and I just kind of want to talk to you about elevating your skincare and um, makeup results. So one of the first things I'm going to recommend is satin lips. I'm going to take it out of its box right here because uh, I needed a new one. So I've opened up a new one for demo. Okay, here it is. These are, this is $22. It is a lip mask and a lip balm. It is a set. Can you buy them individually? Yes, you can. But when you use them together, this is one of the keys to a flawless finish because your lip mask is going to exfoliate dead skin on your lips, dead skin on your lips and your lip balm. After, so you apply it. I'm not going to take my makeup off. I am going to put a little bit of makeup on in just a minute, but you exfoliate dead skin all over your lips, right? That brings the natural collagen level and color to your lips up to the surface. And what I love, 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 what I love, love, love um, is that your lips are so smooth. They're so conditioned because after you do the mask, you take your washcloth and you buff your lips. You get the dead skin off of your lips and then you put the lip balm on and it's got a cool it's very unisexual I tell the guys they're not going to grow boobs using it right can you see that okay it's just kind of an angled tip let me do it this way there we go and then you would apply the lip balm some of my things are falling you can see I'm in a different place tonight I just thought it would be fun to kind of have a different background and whatnot. So I hope you find this to be pleasant and um, a nice change. Anyway, again, lip mask, get rid of dead skin and then lip balm to condition and really smooth out your lips, the condition of your lips. And this way, the lip liner and the lipstick, everything you put on your lips will go on easier as well as stay on longer. How does that sound? Who likes luscious lips? Comment in the chat. By the way, what are you drinking? I'm going to go ahead and grab my drink because I'll get real dry from talking. Grab it real quick. Hope you guys have a great day. And our monsoon season, who knows what the monsoon season uh, is all about? You can kind of um, Google it and see, but it started this afternoon. Finally, it was kind of late coming around this year, right? Uh, who knows what I'm talking about? Comment in the chat. Trisha's drinking water. I've got some electrolyte water. It's blood orange. And I put it in my Starbucks cup because I had stopped to get some water. And then um, put some electrolyte powder in it. Anyway, okay, so yes, monsoons, you can see kind of in my window that that way <laughs> over there. You see where the window is. Anyway, 
it's always backwards. And so that, that throws me off. Anyway, so Satin Lips is where I will begin making recommendations to elevate the results of your skincare and makeup efforts, okay? Because this creates luscious lips and we're probably the worst to our lips. We pay attention to everything else, right? But not our lips, not the condition of our lips. And we lick them and we chew on the dead skin and stuff like that. And we shouldn't do that because saliva is the worst thing. For the condition of your lips definitely so $22 satin lips let me go ahead and go on and I just have to mention the satin hands as well which is $37 and it comes in two different flavors fragrance free as well as white tea and citrus okay let's go on I want I should have started out actually by talking about the skin vigorate brush. This is a sonic brush that cleans your skin. It vibrates. It doesn't spin. So this is a sonic brush, not a spinning brush, which isn't so great for you. But this nice sonic brush is going to clean your skin four times better, like 80% better than just using a washcloth or your fingertips. Now, I want to show you how to, there's the cleansing head. I'm going to pop it off and then I'm going to pop on the massage head. Okay. And you can use this after your serum or with a nourishing oil, which I'll talk about in just a second, uh, with the nourishing oil on your neck and decollete area, which is right in through here. Right. So skin vigorate sonic brush, um, the brush sells for $75. It's on special for $60 because of our 60th anniversary. Happy anniversary, Mary Kay. And thank you to our customers for making this possible. It's customers like you that help our business to not just survive, but thrive. Again, the brush is $75 and the massage head um, is a separate attachment and it is $25. Okay. So... The next thing I need to talk about is our, okay, so what can elevate your makeup routine? There's two things that you may or may not be familiar with, and they are a um, under eye corrector, which is a highlighter and a concealer, under eye corrector and a concealer. They're each $16. And what I do is I just put a little, a little dab of the under eye corrector and then a little dab of the concealer, right? Let's see. Okay. And then I mix it. Can you see it right here on my hand? Right there. And then I mix it. You can see kind of a palette that I'm working from. And then what I do is I... And there is a brush for this, but I stipple. And the key is right here. This lift, this area right in here is your facelift. It just brightens and it gives. You guys, this is hard to do without a mirror. <laughs> and my table is too small to put the table that I'm using because I'm usually set up in my office or in the bathroom. And I've got a counter that I could use, right? But... I just thought I would jump on today from a different area and have a different background. Okay, so there you go with that. Now, what I want to do is I'm going to blend this into my hand so that I don't get it all over the place. And I'm going to take the under eye corrector. I'm going to have to put my, I want to show you where to put under eye corrector and the contour. Are you guys ready for this? Grab your notepads. And let me go get, let me go pick out something. Actually, let my dog in because I'm here by myself and he's whining. Hold on.
Okay. Okay, guys, have you commented what you're drinking? Let me look at the comments. Hi, Mari Cruz and Tony. I'm so glad that you jumped on. Definitely, Trisha. I see Candace and Melissa Castaneda. Hello, Melissa. I hope you're finding this to be very helpful. Okay. So again, I'm going to see if what I can do is maybe um, use this as a mirror because I need to be able to see. Okay. I want to show you how to um, use concealer. I'm sorry, under eye corrector. They look exactly alike. So I really have to look at them. Do you guys have that trouble? Probably not, just me. <laughs> right? Okay. So here is a contour and we have a powder contour. But for the camera, it's so much easier for me to use the stick instead of the powder. We have powder, we have stick. It's just up to you. Okay. So with the highlighter, you saw what to do with highlighter and concealer, mixing it together and blending and going up to this area to give you a lift and uh, brightness around the eyes. Then what I, I would be doing if I, I was already, I already had some makeup on. I did not use my, you know, highlight and contour today. So I'm going, you would put it here down the bridge of your nose here and here, okay? So highlighter, $16, goes in the middle of your face. Your contour is gonna go on the outside of your face and then a little bit on the inside, but right here, right down the bridge of your nose, here and here, okay? All right, let me see who's laughing. I know people are laughing. <laughs> Let's see. Comment your questions, you guys. That's what this is for. This is not for me to entertain you guys. This is so that I can share with you and you share with me your tips, your tips and tricks on skincare and makeup. Okay. All right. So you guys, those of you who have questions, go ahead and comment in the chat, right? Isn't this cool? You can see who's commenting. Um, comment your questions because when you ask questions, you not only learn, but it helps the algorithm, which helps me. So I so appreciate you asking questions. Okay, I'm going to blend my under eye corrector. I'm going to take, okay, and I'm just going to blend it. Like I said, there is a brush that is used for this. It's a flat brush. It's about $14. It's either $12 or $14. I always sell it in a bundle. So forgive me. Okay. And when you blend it, you keep it in its place. You don't blend it all over. You blend it right where it is at. Okay. And then I always like to go um, above my eyebrows and kind of highlight that area okay and then again i'm doing this without a mirror guys so be patient with me okay here to bring out your lower lips but also the biggest thing is right here and here so take a look mm -hmm. let's see this side and then right across okay and then for your cheeks mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you want to go here and here. Here and here. And then I always do it on my forehead. Just a little mark here and a little mark here. So it's just a little, just to kind of, in case you have a five head instead of a forehead, right? Blend it in, blend it in. Okay, next time I'm going to get like a big table somewhere and set all my stuff on it and be able to maneuver just a little bit. But I think you guys are getting the gist of it, aren't you? So it's at the bottom, not the bottom, but mm -hmm. 
So what you're doing is shoring up your cheekbones. So by putting the contour here, it uh, darkness or contour pushes in or recesses and the highlighter brings out, okay? So you guys tell me if it's blended or not, because I'm just seeing what's on the camera and that may or may not be what is blended. Okay, and then you're gonna take, I have a nice blending brush that I use for this. I just, I'm so used to using my fingers on camera. Just know that we have a special blending brush that works beautifully for this. And then blend that little line right there. But this highlights the nose. It, again, highlighter brings out and contour recesses, okay? And so what you wanna do here is blend. What you're doing is chiseling your jaw, chiseling your jaw. This helps with, um, you know, like a double chin or anything like that. Remember, kind of blend it. You're shoring up your cheekbones here. Okay, shoring up your cheekbones. Okay, makes sense. And then blend right here. Of course, I already had lipstick on, but when the darkness pushes in and the light brings out. So this right here, make sure my fingers are still clean. Um, Brings, uh, makes your upper lip a little fuller and then recesses this, all right? So it really is quite helpful. Um, again, your concealer or under eye corrector is just $16. They look exactly alike. So be sure that you're getting either a concealer or an under eye corrector or both of them, because as I mentioned, I use them together for this. 10 year facelift where it lifts and gives brightness to the eye areas and lifts that area. Now, another must have set to help elevate the results of your skincare and makeup needs is two things. It is your finishing spray. This is our Scandinavia finishing spray. This sells for $20. And I just do it in an X and then a cross. And it is finishing spray. It's going to set the makeup, keep it on all day long. Now, when I'm putting full foundation today, I only wore CC cream because I took Baxter for a really, really long walk and just wore him out. Um, and then I just kind of kept that makeup on. I touched it up, but I kept that makeup on. So finishing spray, that's uh, $20. You guys, somebody correct me. It's either 18 or it's 20. So somebody look it up real quick and then comment in the chat how much the uh, finishing spray, Scandinavia finishing spray is for me, please. Sometimes when the camera is going, it's like, I know this, but then you forget. And then you want to set it with silky setting powder. I love this stuff. This is $20. I know this is $20 and it just sets the makeup. You're not going to see, you remember all those lines I had from the contour? You're not going to see them anymore. I love it. I love it. I love it. The idea is that you don't see it, right? And then I'm going to dust here. Woo, got it on my blouse just a little bit, but I'm going to dust. And then normally I would start with my blush and then go to lips and go to eyes, but for time purposes, I needed to have some of this done. You guys, has this been helpful? Silky setting powder, $20. The brush is like $16. And the brush is just one of the tools to use your powder. And I just love it. And then the uh, finishing spray. Did somebody comment? Let me put my glasses on and see if somebody commented. Okay. Okay. Trisha says that the finishing spray is $20. Thank you, Trisha. I so appreciate that. You guys, Tony and Mara Cruz, Melissa, you guys, if you have any questions, guess what? I bet you 
customers have questions too. So ask away in the comments. And then if not on camera, then afterwards, I'll go back and answer all of your questions. Remember, it helps the algorithm. It helps me. And you get in a monthly product drawing for just telling us where you're coming from, what you're drinking, and maybe asking a question, whatever. Every time you comment, you get in um, the drawing. Lastly, I want to share with you, okay, this is a difference maker. So your Skin Vigorate brush makes a difference. I've got makeup on my brush head. Anyway, it makes a difference in the cleansing process. It's a form of, this is a form of exfoliation. It's a form of uh, stimulation. It stimulates your skin. That's, this is, it's like massage. It's really good for you. Really good for you. Okay. And it's on special in the month of actually till September, because we're celebrating our 60th anniversary. I'm so excited. We're going to be going to seminar and, and have a big old 60th anniversary celebration. So again, Skin Vigorate brush, normally 75 on special for 60. The massage head is an added attachment that you just pull this off and snap that on. It's that easy. Okay. But here's what I want to share with you. Your ladies, those of you using any kind of serum, especially the lifting serum, this is $74 by itself. I want you to mix it with the nourishing oil. So what you'll do is, no, oh, this is a brand new one, so I'm not going to pump. You'll put a pump or two right here on your hand, and then you will put a drop, just pretend like I did, and put a drop right inside. Actually, I put two because I'm going to do my neck as well. You blend it with any serum that you're going to be using, and then you apply it to your face. Also, do it on your throat. This helps with turkey neck, and it, it just helps tremendously. Oh, and then you take your massage brush. Can you hear it? Oh, it feels good. It looks good. It's healthy. It's nourishing for the skin. It's coconut oil, sesame seed oil, and olive oil in the nourishing oil. Now, I want to tell you about an extra special, special, the steal of a steal of a deal tonight. That is when you purchase your nourishing oil. Well, let me grab it. I got to close the lid because I took two drops. You guys, this will last you a long time. It really will. But when you purchase the nourishing oil, it's $50. Then you can get either your lifting serum or any of the serums so that you can use them together right after your cleanser at half price. So if this is $74, you're going to pay how much? $37.50, right? For uh, $37, $37 even would make $74. <gasps> oh my gosh, buy a nourishing oil for $50 and get lifting serum at half off or your vitamins, your replenishing vitamin C plus vitamin E, which is $60, you'd get it for $30. Or you could get the pore minimizer. That is a serum as well. I recommend the replenishing vitamin C plus E or the lifting serum is my favorite. It lifts and tightens. It's this, this is like Botox in a bottle. Nourishing oil can be used on your face. You can mix it with your moisturizer. It can be used on your neck, on your hair, on your elbows, on your body. With your body lotion, put a drop or two of the nourishing oil, bam game changer. I'm telling you, you guys, I hope you've had so much fun tonight, learning more about the products, uh, listening to the specials going on. Mm -mm. Let me just share with you on a monthly basis for now, I'm doing a monthly deal. When you spend $50, you purchase $50 of whatever you so desire, then you can get any one of these 12 items at half off.
for every $50 you spend, you get an additional item at half off. So maybe you need one of the boosters for hydration, fine lines and wrinkles, dark spots, or resurfacing. Maybe you need the targeted action toning lotion. This is the bomb diggity. This is for cellulite. It's to tighten the skin and deeply hydrate the skin. Maybe you need a foundation primer or here is your finishing spray that we talked about tonight. Remember, when you spend 50 or more, you get any one of these items at half off. In the month of July, Pilar, I believe, has put in the group her mom wasn't feeling well, so she's not here with us tonight. So mom, we hope you get to feeling better. But I believe Pilar has put this flyer in the feed where you can see it. And then tonight's extra special was when you buy the nourishing oil for 50, you can get your lifting serum or your replenishing serum vitamin C plus E at half off. This one would be half of 74. <sighs> which is 37 and your vitamin C plus E would be normally 60, but you'd get it for $30. You guys, these are the, and then some products. These are the things that elevate your skincare results and your makeup results. Hey, you guys comment. What was your favorite? I gave you five of them. What was your favorite? Was it the Concealer and under eye corrector, they're each $16. And I use a contour with it. And that too is $14. Was it the finishing spray and silkening setting powder? Silkening setting powder is $20. And the finishing spray is also $20. Was it the skin vigorate? Side breast and massage head. This is normally 75. It's on special for 60. You say $15 and this is just 25. Or was it the satin lips for $22? Or of course, the, the bada bing, bada bang uh, that you liked the best. Which one did you like the best? I do want to share that at night when you're washing your face, you always want to use your Mary Kay eye makeup remover. Definitely use a cotton ball or a cotton round. And what you do is you saturate the cotton uh, round, you place it on your eye, you count one, two, three, and then swipe, right? And this way there's less tugging and pulling around your eye area. Now, these are going up next month. They're $18 now. They're going to be $20 next month. But here's another special. BOGO. When you buy one, you can get the second one at half off. And right now, you could buy it for $18. So your second one would be $9. Shut the front door, right? Steal of a deal. Would you agree? Anyway, now... You got to see the specials that when you spend $50, you get any additional item at half off. So if you spend 100, you get two half off items, 150, you get three half, item, half off items, so forth and so on. Now, last but not least, I want to talk with you. I want to share with you a little bit about Mary Kay. What would an extra three to $500, I was going to show a video to you, but we're running low on time. I'm going to post it right here in the group. Okay. Watch it. It's only not even 30, I think it's 33 seconds long, but what would you do with an extra 300 to $500 a month? Would you pay down some pressing bills? Would you save for college, save for wedding? Would you maybe go on a little vacation or put wood flooring in the living room? I don't know, but in this economy, with gas being the prices that they are, even that they've come down just a little, they're still astronomical. They're still high, right? Eggs are still high. Hamburger meat is still high. Rent and oh my gosh, the economy. So many things are so expensive. It's, it's 
it's unreal. It really is. So having a side hustle, having something to do to either save money, make money, or be a boss babe and create retirement or create an additional flow of income for your family might be something for you to take a look at. Again, what would an extra three to $500 a month do for your household budget, for your family? Have you ever found yourself at the kitchen table paying your bills thinking, ah, if I just had an extra three to $500, $200, $400, whatever it is, this might be something to consider. I want you to know that there's three ways to start a Mary Kay business. But first, I want you to know why or how women do a Mary Kay business. They do it one of three ways. They do it as a brand ambassador to save money, right? She's a savvy shopper. She loves the product. She loves the company and believes in the company's philosophies. So she wants to do Mary Kay to buy it at wholesale right there and be able to save some money in this economy, right? Or some women want to make money as a side hustle, a side gig, right? You know, again, not only in this economy, but after COVID and so many women took a look at what they're doing with their time. And so many women enjoyed working from home, right? We've got a large percentage of the workforce working from home, even still. And this is something that can meet that need. So some women come into Mary Kay to make money as a side hustle. You can do a little or you can do a lot, right? And then last but not least is building something new. Build something of your own to retire for to supplement your retirement, your family's income, or to create a different type of lifestyle. So whether you come in to save money as a savvy shopper, make money as a side hustle, do it around your existing commitments, your your work, your community efforts, your family, so forth and so on, or do it as a boss babe and build something new towards supplementing your family's income, retirement, so college funds, if you have children, oh my gosh, so forth and so on. You guys, I've showed you how you can do Mary Kay. Now let me show you what it costs to do Mary Kay. You can do Mary Kay with an e-start for $30. You get a free website and a credit card processing account. Nothing comes in the mail because you're a digital business owner, right? You can get started with a Facebook page, go live, do things like that. Let people know what you're doing. Um, or you can choose a starter kit. Now, this is the most advantageous way to start a Mary Kay business, if I may share with you. And it's over $400. Look at the box. See the box with all the products. You know what? We've got a new consultant on here. Welcome aboard, Tricia. And comment in the chat what it was like. Was it like Christmas getting the box? and being able to open things up. I mean, oh my gosh, the products. Over $400 in actual product comes in this starter kit. Now, with the starter kit as well, you get a free website and a credit card processing account, just like you do with the eStart. So whether you start with a $30 beginning package or the starter kit, you get a free website and a credit card processing account. You know, Dave Ramsey says the best way to start a business is with somebody else's money. And for just $30 or $130, whether you use your money or uh, uh, do it on a card where it's 0% interest and, and it can be paid back and even increase your credit score, that's a wise businesswoman, right? You know, it was Mary Kay that I got out of debt with Mary Kay um, selling my products. And I, I was doing a bridal program in the Bay Area. And I really pride myself in helping women stretch their dollar as far as it will go. My customers, my consultants, my family, my friends, I invite you to consider something like Mary Kay. I invite you to consider 
a sisterhood like Mary Kay. It's no, there's no other sisterhood out there that's like Mary Kay. We're a small family. We're a big family, actually. And, you know, really what we do is teach people to do to their skin what we do to our skin every day and make a difference. One connection, one relationship, one face at a time. Remember, you are blessed to be a blessing. You are a blessing to me. I hope tonight has helped you, has taught you some things. I hope you're commenting away, asking questions, because when we're done, I'll come back here and I'll answer any questions that were going on while I was doing this live. You guys, hey, if you're a consultant, we've got a guest speaker Wednesday night, 7 to 735. Uh, Trisha Pacheco is going to be speaking to us, uh, visiting director, and then we're going to do our year-end awards. I invite you to join us. I invite you to wear red, red, white, or blue as we celebrate our country's independence as well as our independent, being an independent beauty consultant with Mary Kay Cosmetics. I love what I do, and I'd love to share more with each and every one of you. Thanks guys for being here tonight. It has been a pleasure. Bye-bye.